Hello everybody, how are you? Um, it's me, Mr. Wolf, to the one here, and today, after a long ass time, I decided that I'm gonna start a gameplay series, finally, for a pretty old game, though, uh, called Cognition and Erika Read Thriller, if I'm not mistaken. This game came out, uh, two years, um, like in 2013, I believe, yeah. It's pretty old, I mean, most of you have probably played it by now, or actually watched a uh, gameplay of it, or walkthrough, or whatever, but, I mean, I just got it uh, from Steam, and I really, really want to play this game. I'm gonna lie to you, I played the first 30 to 1 hour of this game, because I didn't, thought I'm gonna, I'm gonna make this a gameplay series, because it's an old game, but I have to make a video, because, I mean, I have the reason that you don't send any code from me for the past one month, I believe, I upload a video, or maybe less. Um, I haven't actually got time because I'm writing exams, you know, and I'm really, really busy. But you know what the hell? I have like a few days before I write, you know, uh, the next uh, you know, thing for my exams, so I can make a few videos from this game. So hope you all enjoy. Um, I'm not gonna spoil any story for you right now, but we're gonna start a new case and see what this game is all about. Hope you enjoy it. I have turned on the subtitles and everything, and I'm gonna shut up when they're talking, so you can enjoy the voice acting and everything. Just hurry, John. I'm doing what I can. Did you call? Yes, I did. Drive faster. We'll save him, Erica. All right, then. That's our introduction. Our intro cutscene. If you want to call it, I'm gonna turn off the notifications for Erica, Steam. Wait for backup. Screw that's, backup. That's, they won't be here in time. Now we are. We've got to find the cane killer before he hurts Scott. So I've read the first sequel thing that we get here. The first sequel comic, I guess, when you buy the game, the first sequel comic included. And as far as I know. There was a killer, and there is a killer right now, on the loose that actually, you know, takes uh, siblings, you know, and actually kills, tries to kill one of the siblings and gets the other one, uh, leads to save her brother or his brother, so he's, he's pretty messed up, dude, but that's the story, so uh, once you get the game, you get this, like, uh, phone or whatever says, you know, Eric, it's your dad, just woke up, still recovering from the knockout, I didn't see the killer when he took Scotty, all I can do now is try to help you through here as best as I can, please text me for many problems you you may be facing, I'll give you my best advice, you can save him, please be careful, so, this phone will be your hint page, um, like if you press the phone right here and you have the message, I mean you can now there's a warning, this is the hint system, so this person is the hint system. Every time you need help, you can message to your dad or any other person and it will give you some sort of advice. It's pretty helpful if you get stuck. So, you can drive with the wall by clicking on any object that causes the cursor to highlight and then choosing the desired interaction. These are content sensitive. To open your inventory, click on the tab in the top right or in the top right corner on the screen. So this is our inventory right here. We can click on anything and we're actually gonna equip it and we can interact with it. So I know what I'm gonna do right now, I have to shoot this block right here. So to get a cutscene. I'm sure McAdams can't wait to hear what we're doing. I'll take the blame. Sure, that'll make it all better, especially since he took you off the case. My brother isn't there. 
I don't give a rat's ass what McAdams thinks. Right. Right. Now I'll shut it down now we can open it I guess. Well guys, how do you like my sound? It's not a new make, but it's a make that I got and I tend to change in this before I get like a better one. So let me down in the comments if you like the sound. So I might keep it, you know. For now at least. But from the test I run it's pretty good. What is it, Red? Just my... my intuition, I guess. Weird. Um, so, uh, this girl, Red right here, got, like, psychic thing that whatever she touches, it can see, you know, the past of the objects she touches. It's pretty helpful for the game and for herself, of course. So, twice run yeah we know we know we know we know I've run those things I'm gonna take a look for the footprints right here. here these look like fresh footsteps yes they're fresh footsteps what can we do with them the trail dies out quickly I wonder I could try using my intuition it's always been good but now that Scott's in danger it's crazy strong I'm not sure that I can trust it Tutorial, I recognize this. Yeah, no, no, no. Alright, so click this button here and. I've had this weird talent since I can remember. I can see images from the past from certain objects by touching them and focusing them. I can always see a faint aura on the things I know hold visions. Alright, then, so, I mean, these, these are the arrows right here, the blue thingies. If we click on these and then we click like, right here, we can see the, the object. We know that the killer, this is the killer by leg. Gun behind of that stone, whatever. So that's a lead. And then we click it again and we click on the such you're gonna see something else. Right. my hands on this bastard he's going to be busy reassembling his face right so I guess now I mean we can see that the shovel here I mean might be useful and it is useful spoilers so let's go back there where the killer has gone so, let me get this my coffee all right so we can see let me actually turn on the mission now we're gonna take a look at the footprints of that guy. That's him, yeah. Just spawn the shovel out of his back. GTA style. Now know that he actually dig something in there. I can't dig with my. Oh, yeah, sorry. You can actually. The cane killer was digging here. Yeah. So I guess we open this toolbox. Someone must have left this here. Yep. So let's open it up and see what's inside. Where? I'm gonna get those stuff. Let's see. A hammer and a. Yeah, they could. So, take those. Right. So, I, in my first gameplay, actually tried to use a hammer. That so, won't you know, work okay, there. But doesn't work. But as, as I told you, we saw a hammer in the statue. You know, right here. So, to actually try to investigate these. 
to the statue. I can't break it off with my bare hands. So, first gameplay, of course, I tried the gun to actually shoot it. That won't work there. But it doesn't work. I'll try the white color. I'm gonna try everything just, you know, we can see what it says. That won't work there. Nothing. So, you know, big deal. You gotta use a hammer, of course. And we actually break the hand and take the shovel. It figures. I'm in a cemetery and the only shovel in sight is stuck in a marble hand. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, we got the shovel, that's good. Reason, I guess. Oh God, Scott, please be all right. Scott, you can figure out he's her brother, and we try to actually find him and help him. So now, before I go around the bug and try to dig him, we're gonna take a look at this mausoleum right here. What the hell? John! This is definitely the Kane Killer's work. So it says here only read blood. Uh, Reed is the name of the girl, so we can see that he actually needs our blood. It's right here. Right now, that's all you actually have to do here. I mean, we can take a look at this. Missing here. What? Yeah, let me go in actually. Let me. There's something. Let's take a look around. Yeah, okay, that was said. We can actually try to some... use it, but since Miss something, there's a camera here. So we can figure out that he's watching us. So let's exit and try to go around the bug and actually dig. Really hope this thing game sound isn't that high. I mean, we can actually try and lower it a bit. But no, no, no. No, no, there's no need for it, I guess. No need, no need, it's pretty good. So now we're gonna use the shovel to actually dig here. See what we will find. There's the same reason again. I can't use this shovel. I keep seeing Scott with that monster. Alright, so that came to me I played it as well. We are gonna talk to Don actually, tell him to dig himself. Let's do that. John, come with me. Sure, Red. Here we are. So let's give him the shovel and tell him to what dig. What do you want? Silence. Let's take a look around. Right, so I have the shovel, so you can do him. John. John. Will you take this and dig? I know there's something here. And you take your coffee with two sugars and no milk? John, this isn't funny. So, John, if you haven't figured Sorry. that out. Yes, man. He's the funny character in this game. You know, every game has got a funny character. And he does a pretty good job, I guess. Alright, come on. He's faster, dude. Jesus Christ. Long ass time. There! What are you looking for? That! What? That! Alright, that! He's looking for that. He's looking for that. Let's look at what he's all about. What is this thing for? Why was he hiding it? Yeah, what's this thing? Let's take a look.
What is that? I'm not sure, but I'm about to find out. <coughs> for that, so let's see what we found out. Stone wheel. All right. So I guess. I mean, the stone wheel is actually useful for you know. Massively, I mean, the wall is so there. Come on, I have to wait for him to go over there. Can I click it now? No? Alright, there we are. Let's take a look here. And actually, use this shit. Let's... Yeah, we gotta put our feet there, I'm pretty sure. Do you know what that is? Looks like a pressure plate. Yeah, yeah. We gotta put our feet there. Right. This must be the right piece. Yes. This right here is a pretty gory scene. You gotta see why. nothing. Erica, we should wait for backup. I may not have your intuition, but even I can see this is a really bad idea. There's no time. Scott's life depends on me now. Righty. Before we turn these up. Right here. Here's how this will work. There we are. Erica, stop! John, let me do this. Alright, so. That's it! Whoa! It's a trap! Get out of there! Only read blood. Of course. He's watching us. And only my blood will open this door. That's ridiculous. He might not even be here right now. I'm not taking that chance. Step off that crazy thing, now! You stay right there. Whoa, 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 Red! Stay the hell back, John. Eric, think this through. He has my brother in there. My baby brother. I appreciate what you're doing, but step the fuck back because I'm doing this. Fine. All right, then. Um, turn it again, I guess. Erica, uh, it's not too late to think this through. I'm fine. God damn it! Why do you have to be so damn stubborn? Another time, I guess. Uh, I don't know if I would do that. Ah, fuck! Mm. Please, I'm begging you. Uh, one more time. So I don't know about you guys, but this game has an amazing atmosphere so far. That's why it actually draw it, draw, <laughs> draw me to playing this more. And it really reminds me a game from Telltale. You know the actual, you know, gameplay and everything. It really reminds me 
game from Telltale, you tell tale, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good, I really really like it, and I'm really, really loving this one. Although, I'm not that good to, for... Oh, Scott! Erica, please get me out of here. Oh, Scott. What has he done to you? Ugh. Alrighty then. So yeah, I'm not that good on point and click games, especially point and click puzzle games, but this game has a pretty, pretty normal state of puzzles, so let's take a look on Bastard! This. this device is even more complicated than the ones he used in the other murders. Alrighty, so can we actually no I don't wanna try to do anything, I don't wanna This trap is for me. Scott and I were the cane killer's newest target. The bastard. He takes siblings. Alright then. Uh, what else? Why are we gonna open the curtain? These curtains look pretty old and flimsy. Talk about a fire hazard. Hmm. Candelabra. It fits his M.O. He likes to decorate everything. As if it's some sort of ritual. It's sick. Yeah. Having these so close yeah. to the curtains isn't a very good idea. Hmm. I mean, this is a... You know, cables. Oh, we only have cables. The cables lead to that panel. Alright then. Let's take a look at this one, I guess. This seems to be connected to the trap. Maybe I can deactivate it from here. Alrighty. Let's try that. I'm not trained for disabling these. Maybe I can call Terrence. He's good with this stuff, and he studied Kane's previous traps. Hello? Terrence, what's your location in ETA? Uh, we're on route, 15 minutes. That's too late! I have one of his traps going off in T-10. Um, is it attached to Scott? Send me a picture. See it? Yeah, it, he's used something similar before. You have to cut the wires in the reverse order, from the way they were connected. How the hell am I supposed to know how it was connected? I'm sorry, I, I don't know what else to tell you, Erica. Okay, just hurry. Think, Erica, think. Erica. I'm figuring this out. Hang in there. And then, so I'm not gonna spoil or anything, but I've already did this because it took me several tries actually. So I know the combination of how I have to cut the wire, so you know, make this fast. So this is first spoiler alert if we do this wrong nothing changes goes to the same screen the same you know conclusion so, just so you know then it's the black cable right here then yellow I mean, it's pretty easy to figure it out actually. It only took me like two senses to actually figure that thing out, but you know. Then red. I mean, once you find this combination right here blue, black, yellow, you can see that it's gonna go right, you can go like from down now. Red, um,. Orange and then um, green, you know, it goes like that. It's pretty easy once you figure out the three first um, cables. So, got the red. Then orange and then the green one. So we did it, and we're gonna end up in the same exact situation that we were we lost. Just so you know, but I didn't lose because I don't wanna spend too much time here. I wanna show you more gameplay as I can the first episode. So we're gonna try to hit him with it. Uh, why don't I have the hammer here? Whoa. Why don't I get the hammer? Serious? I believed I got the hammer, didn't I? I guess I didn't. What?
Um, all right, I'm gonna try to actually. That was fucking weird. I mean, I had the hammer in my previous game, but why don't I get it now? What is? I didn't let it sound, did I? That was weird. We even though they hit him like you know, I guess. Yeah, we just kind of it. Okay, that works. Yeah. So we're gonna burn him to the fucking ground, this guy. We have to wait the fucking 12 minutes to figure out the Come on, where are we gonna actually. That's how you. you know. Do this section of the game. We actually burn him. But he actually manages to escape, which is really, really sad. Check for the background noise he, you, you might have here right now. But stuff happens in my play right now. Anyways. Okay, Scotty. We're getting out of here. Yeah, we saved him. That's fucking awesome. Yes, no. All right, we did all that for nothing. Didn't save our brother. That's great. That's the prologue, right here. Here we are. Now is that supposed to prologue? The guy is up here. So, I don't know how long this video is, but I'm guessing I'm gonna have it right there when it ends. Uh, am I? I really don't know. I mean, I might have. I don't know. 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 I don't you know, the Telltale games. The King Killer. Very little better of investigation, okay then. We get it for later. This is a brother, Scott. No. <laughs> no. So, I guess we close the investigation. Okay, so do we find the guy or what? By the time you find him, you won't be able to do anything about it. You'll be blind from staring at that screen in the dark. I like it this way. I can be half asleep and work at the same time. Egg sandwich? It's two in the morning. Exactly. Time for breakfast. Did you hear? Davies closed the cane killer case. I heard. And yet, here you still are at 2 a.m. I'm just... 
Making sure everything's in order before it's sent to the archives. Why are you here? I pick up my phone in the middle of the night. Apparently you don't. Oh, crap. I didn't hear it ringing. Davies? I'm sure it isn't pretty. No, it ain't. Lots of blood and guts, they say. <laughs> or maybe I dreamed it. You sure you don't want your egg sandwich? You can have it. Come on, Skippy. Davies will have our asses if we don't show up ten minutes ago. You know how I hate that name, don't you? I do, Skippy. Man, that egg sandwich smells good. You sure? <laughs> Let's go. So this is like our loading screen for, you know, the city we're going or whatever. I'm going to the crime scene. So yeah, I think I'm gonna cut this thing down here. Um, I hope you enjoyed the prologue of this game. I mean, I'm sure, sure the best things are coming right about now. Um, so write a comment down below if you like it. If you like the game, if you wanna see more, please, please, please leave a like. And so I guess I'm gonna see you in the next episode. Yeah, why not? Why not? Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Have a nice day.